chalk, lines on the ground. Each color corresponds to an event. The one mile walk is lined in blue. The 5K run is lined in red. And the 10K run is lined in white. Stay on your line and you'll be fine. I repeat, stay on your line and you will be fine. Thanks, Glenn. Some volunteers will be also be present along with the course for direction. To begin, one mile walkers will cross out by the fountain and all runners will proceed down the avenue of flags where the 5K and 10Ks run split. The one mile walk in both runs will finish just by the fountain by the tiny map. Once again, the 5K and 10K rounds will be time for fun. We have volunteers today from the Marine Corps League and several others who have stepped up at the last minute to help. We thank you for helping make the day as po the day possible. Race staff are in yellow shirts for questions or direction. There are water stations for 10K runners in Bob Mays Park and Sunset Cemetery. Drinks and snacks are available for participants after the race in the shelter house. There will be awards for place finishers of the 5K and 10K runs, which will fall after the race. Also make sure that I'm guessing all of you have signed your raffle tickets because we're going to have those drawings now. We have a custom 31 bag tote and then two gift cards, one for the men and one for the women on the shoes. And we shall do that now. Thank you to this year's sponsor, Doors and More, uh, this year's route sponsors in the Holiday Inn of Quincy and today's Tony's Restaurant. Again, we will have a prayer by the Eleanor Advisor Chapel on the Hall. Next presentation of the flag of the American Legion Post 37. Then Alicia McCarl will perform our national anthem. But first, let's do the raffles. Yep. 